music scene chatting and hello and i'm going to show you how i use content manager and a set of Corsa without ever touching the keyboard and mouse and as some of you may know from following me on my twitch stream is that i do race a lot and also cruise a lot in vr and manage a twitch stream all in vr and the last thing i want to do is fumble around with the keyboard and mouse i've done it for months and it's a huge pain in the butt so what i ended up doing was i created a bunch of uh, voice act activated macros or voice activated commands that uh, do a whole bunch of things for me in content manager and a sort of Corsa and also in OBS and things like that music volume though so uh, and also some of the um, macros also rig they also um, make these two buttons on my uh, steering wheel they'll do these two buttons will do various things depending on what is happening in game or in the uh, in content manager so let's just uh, jump in face let's just jump in and show you what is uh, what I'm what I mean by this so let's just jump into the demo in content manager so uh, scene content manager scene content manager all right, so first thing we've got to do is launch Content Manager and face. All right, so we're going to launch Content Manager and uh, I'll basically say start. And that will launch Content Manager. Okay, so there's Content Manager on screen. I'm going to, I've got two main menu screens, music volume low. So I'll, if I say menu settings, that loads up my settings menu, which is I spend uh, so a few, you know, a lot of time here trying to tweak things. I can say menu drive, menu drive. Okay, that'll go to the drive menu. And what else do we have here? We've got practice. This will bring up the single practice session. I can say race. That'll bring up the single race session. Then there's also, let's say for instance, I'm in a single practice session. I can pick the three common cars that I'd like to drive in or practice in. So if I say practice, car GT3. Okay, so that's the, this is the McLaren 650S that I practice a lot uh, offline and also on, on the server. I can say car sesto car p1 all right so all that's pretty self-explanatory same thing with the tracks uh, what else okay so let's say i want to join uh the server like online i can say kunos this will bring up the list of kunos tracks or kunos servers i can say akr and a AKR and this is the AKR racing league is the league that I race in and this is their current practice track but for now let's actually jump into Esota Corsa in a in an offline uh, single player mode so let me actually oh, I've got a little script here that I'm going to follow because uh, otherwise I'll forget things practice go all right so sort of Corsa is launching right now drive and chat and we're just uh, waiting for sort of Corsa to load and while it's loading I need to do yeah the menu the window will adjust itself start all right, sweet. So usually from this point onwards, I'm on track. Uh, usually what I do is I have the headset on, so I'll do that now. Hmm, interesting. No, wait, you know what? I need to leave a sort of Corsa and come back in the GT3. So leave a sort of co leave AC. Yes. All right, we need to actually select the right car. So car GT3. 
car GT3. Go. Okay, drive and chat. Again, let's wait for it to load. And I'll have my uh, headset back on. And uh, start. Sweet. So the, usually the first thing I do is, there's no point you seeing my face. So it's better for you to see rig. So, okay. I normally have my hands on the wheel and uh, we'll go into the the full sort of this, a scene that I call shut up and drive. Shut up and drive. All right. So the shut up and drive scene is just big screen with, you know, very minimal borders and crap like that, except for the webcam. Uh, okay. AC menu navigation. Let's go into the setup screen. So setup, setup, setup. Yes. All right, so enter menu. And from here, I can suspension, generic. And what I'm doing is I'm using my paddle, flappy paddles to navigate left and right. And let's say, for instance, I want to add some uh, fuel. I can just. Uh, let's go. Let's go back. All right, so hang on. We have hit a slight little bug. Fuel. Okay, so we, now we're in fuel. If I go and press the this button, add and remove. If I go back, I can tie compound. And I'm just basically using flappy paddles to increase and decrease the values. I'm using... Uh, the left and right buttons to change the menu. So now I'm in LR. Uh, what else? So let me just go through my script and make sure we've got the baseline. Oh yeah, so we need to load some my... Let's go back. So in the, in the setup section, we've got all right, so if I want to load my test uh, setup, I can say load test, load test. Okay, there's the test, load qual, load race. All right, so for now, let's load, load test because I'm testing. And then let's hit the road. So usually what happens from here is I'll... Um, Go back and hit drive. The in VR, what happens is uh, the I'm not usually looking where the game is looking, so I'll say reset VR, reset VR, and that basically lets me reset the headset to so I'm looking nice and straight. Um, and sometimes the mouse, actually, I'll move the mouse so just to demonstrate it clear mouse all right so sometimes the mouse point is like right in the middle or you know some weird place or it, it's open up the context it's open up the menu on the right hand side here so i usually say clear mouse and it moves the mouse to the bottom left here so it's out of the way and uh, what else can i do from here i can say lights on lights off Okay, if I actually jump out of the car, view pivot, pivot left, lights on, lights off, view cockpit. Um, there are other voice commands like starting and uh, stopping the wipers if it's raining, but it's not raining right now. Uh, traction up and track, TC up and TC, uh, TC up and down, ABS up and down. Oh, obviously, those are kind of hopefully self-explanatory. Uh, one of the things I use a lot is overlays. So let me just start driving. And I'll uh, basically... Uh, I'm not sure if you guys use overlays, but overlays, I have 
three main overlays that I use. One is overlays config. Overlays config. All right, so this overlay contains my force feedback controller, mirrors, and the seat position. And it's super important to have these things dialed in uh, for me when I drive, the, uh, especially the onboard settings, the seat position, because just so, you know, so it feels like I'm actually sitting in the right spot in the car, in VR. Uh, the other one is overlay race. This is super important, obviously, because it create it has the uh, Sidekick app. It's got the real time app on the left there. Uh, what else? It's got the uh, heli course, the car radar app, which isn't um, it's not working right now because there's no cars around me. And then there's overlay chat. All right, so the chat overlay. Realistically, this I have to rename this, but this is where I have any apps related to when I do car testing and tuning. Uh, on the right there, you can see Camber Extravaganza and there's a Tires Pro app there. And then if I am just, uh, if I don't want anything in, in my view, in my, in, like a clean overlay, I'll just say overlay clean, overlay clean. You know what I mean? So it's all gone. And the other thing that's really cool, especially for on stream is changing the camera while I'm driving. So I can say view chase, view chase. I can say view chase far, view bonnet, view dash, right? Uh, view full, view cockpit. All right, so we're back to cockpit. Um, then there's also, let me drive forward a little bit and change the view to TV, because otherwise I'll probably end up crashing. View TV. View cockpit. Uh, you saw view pivot before. View pivot. View pivot. And from here I can pivot right. Pivot right. Pivot left. Pivot left view cockpit yeah all right so and uh, so if I'm testing I can actually say say to um, so teleport back to pit I can say box 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 yes so I get a uh, confirmation question saying are you sure I want to pit and I say yes and then it drops me into teleports me into pit or I can say Let's say I've driven out a bit and if I want to just jump into teleport to pits with setup, setup, I can say setup, 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 setup. Yes. All right. So I'm in enter menu and then from here, you know, I can just go back to, you know, more fuel and all that kind of stuff. I can uh, do all that stuff. Um, there is also, let's go back and drop. There is a new, uh, something new I've been playing with, which is replay. Uh, but obviously replay only works in offline, uh, like single player mode. So if I say, uh, actually, I won't show that to you right now. I'll do it in a different video. It'll take too long, but it's basically, uh, controlling the replay with voice, which is pretty, pretty dope actually. Um, like playing and fast forwarding, rewinding, and changing a slow-mo and all that stuff. Uh, so let's say I'm, I'm over, I'm done with this uh, off, offline session. I can say leave AC, leave AC. Yes. So several of these commands have uh, a confirmation question. Are you sure you want to leave AC? Because last thing I want is while I'm racing and all of a sudden it accidentally thinks I've said leave AC or teleport to pits and then, uh, you know, rip my race. <laughs> so the next thing is let's actually join a server and I can show you some chat commands that I uh, activate using voice. So for that, let's go online. I'll say AKR, AKR. All right, so we've selected the AK Racing League practice server and 
go. All right, so we've joined the server. We're just waiting for it to load. And now, uh, drive and chat. Cool, let's just wait for that to load. And let's get the next bunch of script commands ready. We're almost done uh, as soon as this joins. Uh, by the way, yeah, it's, 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 I'm trying to figure out how... This is not an, a how-to. This is a demonstration because I've had a few people come by my stream and say, man, what the hell? Can you show us all the things uh, in one short video? So this is my attempt at a face. Face. This is my attempt at a short video uh, to, sh to condense all the features. Um, start. Let's just jump into a drive now. Reset VR. Clear mouse. Lights on. All right. So let's say I'm driving around and I've got the... I can say something like, say hi. So they see, as you can see, it's actually said hi. Say GG. Say pass right. Say pass left. Uh, what else is there? Say you lead. Say let's go. Say got a pit. Know what I mean? So it's like all those common things. Um, yeah, I guess that's pr probably that's the most uh, f features like voice activated things I do on, on the server because who wants to type while you're driving? Uh, the, the, there is something that's currently in in the work in progress, which is dictating into a into a sort of course of chat. And I'll show you what I mean by that. So I can actually say message AC. Hey, say hello YouTube. Send it. Paying say hello YouTube, you know, that's that's a, the voice recognition isn't the best. I think uh, I'll give it another go. Message AC. Hello world. Send it. Hey, okay, that it, that got it. Anyway, um, you know what? That's it. Let's uh let's wind it out, like wind it down. Um, leave AC. Yes. Scene chatting. And uh, there you have it, folks. Uh, I was thinking this is not a how-to because it's it's a, it's going to take it's going to be a humongous effort to figure out creating a video on how to do it. I can I'm more than happy to do it. I need to get some interest, like real demand from you guys to say, hey, yeah, we want to know how to do this or whatever. If there's enough likes on this video, maybe if there's a million likes, maybe not million, or maybe a thousand likes. <laughs> I'll I'll uh, maybe get around to making a how-to. I'm more than happy to do it. Um, but I really just, you know, I'm not going to do it if no one cares about this kind of stuff. But uh, apart from that, let's just roll credits. Uh, scene roll credits. Thanks for your attention. And uh, yeah, you know, um, basically, thanks for hanging out. If you have any questions, check it out on my stream on the, I'll put all the links in the, in the description and, uh, what else is there to say, but have a fantastic day. Enjoy the music. All this music that's been playing in the background is music by independent artists that I'm, uh, I'm, you know, I'd like to promote and get some exposure and some of them are my great good friends. Uh, yeah, I'll stop talking now and, um, roll the credits. We'll see you next time. I'll actually uh, create another demonstration video on how I use my voice to control my my uh, live stream. So it's very rare that I actually touch the mouse and keyboard when I live stream. That includes changing scenes and uh, like turning up the, mu the music volume, for example. I could say music volume high. I could say music volume, music volume medium. Uh, if I'm driving around and people say they can't hear the game audio, I could say 
game volume high and it'll put the anyway i'll do another demonstration video for that uh, because i know a lot of you've asked for that as well so i'm gonna disappear let the r credits roll completely and uh if you got any questions in the comments as usual you know i'm so glad this video is done because it took me many <laughs> many goes and you know what it's like if you're a content creator see you next time music volume high hide cam